Hey everybody, it's me Sandy and I'm back with another nail art video. This time it's green and gold swirl design using nail vinyls. To be doing this design today, I'm going to be using Envy by Zoya, High Standards from China Glaze, and Nail Vinyls from What's Up Nails. I'm going to start off with my favorite base coat, which is Anchor by Zoya. So I am going to paint most of my nails Envy by Zoya, which is the dark green color, but I am doing my feature nail in High Standards by China Glaze. Such a pretty gold shimmer. I am going to use two coats of each on my nails, and as you can see, I have already done my um, right hand off camera. So now that my polish is all dry, I'm following up with a coat of fast drying top coat. I'm using Sesh Vite, and this is so that there is a top coat on there before I put the nail vinyls on, so that when I pull the nail vinyls off after I've put the swirl design on, my polish below doesn't pull up. Or at least, that's the hope. Now that my top coat is all dry, I'm going to place on these lovely swirl nail decal stencils from What's Up Nails. They're so fun, but they are a little bit difficult to pull up, and apparently I wasn't showing things into the camera again. Sorry, I tried doing it at first with my tweezers, but as always, I tried with the tweezers, and then I found, eh, my finger worked the best. Next, I'm just using a silicone cuticle pusher to just get those nail vinyls securely on my nail so that when I put on the gold polish, it won't bleed through the sides. Now I'm just putting a nice thick coat of the High Standards by China Glaze on to the swirl pattern. And once I'm done that, I am gonna pull the vinyl up right away because you want to make sure that the vinyl will pull up without pulling on the, off the rest of your polish. Still fighting with my tweezers though. So this one didn't pull up very well, but I think it's because I may have pressed it too hard onto my nail. So I repeated these steps on my other nails, of course using the green polish as the swirl color over the gold nail. And again, I am sorry that it's out of the um, camera angle. I'm I'm still learning. And this time I'm only using my finger to press it down. I think part of the problem I had with my thumb was that I secured it too firmly onto my nail. I guess it's a fine line. So I'm just placing on the envy on top of this and then I will pull it off right after I'm done. And as you can see, this one turned out much better. I definitely didn't lift the polish up on this one. So this sheet has a combination of little swirls and bigger swirls, and it's really cool that you can use it as a stencil or as just a nail vinyl that you can stick on. You can do the reverse. It's uh, very versatile. And as you can see, sometimes they're a little hard to pull up, but uh, you know, I have the tools.
So I'm going to put on my anchor top coat now. Before I did this, I did do some touch-ups with my fine liner brush and the green and gold polishes just to make sure all my lines were crisp, especially on my thumb where I had had quite a bit of difficulties, which were totally my error. So all in all, even with my fun with the vinyls, which were all me, I really had fun doing this Manny and I think it turned out really elegant with the contrast between the green and the gold. So thank you so much for watching. If you could just do me a huge favor and that's go down and hit that like button as well as hit subscribe and post notifications so you can find out when I upload a new video. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.